I'm just gonna die out here. That's messed up. Am I ever gonna die? There's smoke out there. What? What is that? Why is there smoke in the middle of nothing? That is very strange. I'm very confused by everything that is happening right now. Hello everybody, I am Kindly Kian and welcome to beta number three for Hello Neighbor. Now we got a little bit of some sad news today. We found out that Hello Neighbor has been delayed beyond its August 29th release date, which was so close, but they felt that they needed to hold it back because the game was just not complete. It hadn't been properly tested. And I gotta be real with you, after playing the last beta, I kind of agree. So it did get delayed until December, I think they said December 8th. I could be wrong on that date. You might wanna double check. I'll have a link to the producers update that was released just a few minutes ago but we also got some good news and that good news is that beta 3 is available to all who pre-ordered hello neighbor so we're actually in beta 3 and it seems that there's a lot of really cool stuff in beta 3 that they've done they've improved the ai they've made it so that his animations are a little bit better he can climb upstairs now uh he could do that in beta 2 or or the first beta in fact um but his animation were kind of goofy so he has proper animations now there's a lot of cool stuff going on in addition to that there's actually a boss in the game and it looks like it might actually be a giant version of the neighbor which seems absolutely insane so I really really want to try and get to that content so we're gonna try it out today I did want to start a new fresh game and just see if anything's new around here you can see the apartment actually looks a little bit different um there's actually like food and stuff over here we got some toast who wants toast anybody throw it in the throw it in the toaster get it in there there we go okay I took the whole bread thing and put it in the toaster that's the way you toast bread put a bread pan on the toaster and then we got a radio this is different. Can I tr I can turn it on. I can actually turn it on. Look at that. That's pretty neat. Okay, that's a that's a new item altogether. Okay, let's go ahead and pick up the letter. Let's see if anything has changed here. It looks like our animations are pretty much the the same up to this point. So, not too much to see. Let's see. Oh, wait. This is different. Yeah, he kind of leans up against the desk here and he's reading the letter. Okay, that that's better. That's definitely better. Now, I don't know why he's moonwalking. Can't really explain that, but find the suitcase, find the key, put the key in the suitcase. Yeah, we know how to do that. We've got a can over here. Just get rid of that guy. Let's see if the neighbor is still hanging out over here in his, his creepiness. Let's see. Yeah, there he is. There he is in all of his glory. His, his feet just kind of hanging through the the side of that apartment building <laughs> this is super weird still can't explain that one okay let's grab the suitcase we've only seen this about a thousand times okay the key should be in one of these drawers assuming that they haven't moved it yep there it is okay go ahead and drop that into the suitcase and i think that's it so let's head out park in front of our nice new house that is completely normal and not weird all right so let's get inside let's grab our key here Go ahead and unlock this guy, get this opened up. All right, that's good. Oh, we get ourselves a little cutscene here. Uh, I, again, I'm doing all this just to see if anything has changed. And up to this point, we did see a minor change in the way that our character actually picked up the letter and read it. Kind of leaned up against that desk there. He didn't do that in the previous version. Let's grab the crowbar, get this guy popped open. And I think this is where we get our introduction to the neighbor. And we'll see if anything's different here. So let's go ahead and pop those guys open. Yep, all right, very good. Get rid of the crowbar. Don't need that anymore. Let's go inside. And this is this is all the same. All the same up to this point. Yeah, he's peeking through. Oh, he's actually in the wardrobe over there. I think before they implied that he was actually in the basement. But he's actually in that wardrobe off to the right side of the screen there. I, I think that changed a little bit from the beta. And this makes a little bit more sense that he's not in the in the basement but uh, again i i don't know i mean they still haven't told us a whole bunch about the actual story of the game but i am very excited to jump into this beta 3 and see what's different okay that that i think was a little bit different that like waking up there was a little bit different oh and you can see us kind of leaning up against the side of the house now we're looking off into the neighbor's house and some Something weird is going on. You can see those animations are totally new. His, wow, what? Okay, he's kind of like worn out here. What? Oh my gosh, this is, <laughs> these animations are totally new. Okay, this is all very, very cool. He was like worn out, like boarding up the, the, uh, the door there, kind of holding it back. 
So someone is behind that door trying to break through it, and he's trying to force them to stay in there, and then he grabs that chair, props it up against the door. Wow, that is kind of creepy. Okay, let's go inside. Let's see what's going on. Walk over to this thing, and then are we going to get ourselves... Uh, oh, hey, hey, no, 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 no. What? What? Okay, we got sent back to our apartment, and I think... That this is the beginning of the game. I think we're like officially in the game now. So they took out all that weird stuff that was going on, kind of teaching you how to hide into the in the in the wardrobe thing, and just kind of took that out, streamlined the whole process. I think this is a lot better. Just get you right into the game. Okay, so we are officially playing Beta Three now, and as you can see, there are some differences. Actually, right off the bat, I notice that there is a generator in a cage on the side of the house. What the heck? Oh my gosh, okay, that is very different from what we've seen in the past. There's also some boarded up windows over there. Oh man, okay, let's get into it. Let's do some exploration. Let's try to get to the basement. Let's see if anything valuable is in our boxes over here. It doesn't look like it. Okay, let's get to it. Let's try to get upstairs. Um, I'm gonna sneak around the side of the house here. Um, I'm not sure where he is. I did see him go inside, so I'm a little bit worried that this is the direction that he went. Oh yeah, he hears us. Oh, he was upstairs, what? Okay, man, you know what actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to find oh, yeah The apple will be good. Um, what I want to do is try to get the elevator room open It's not really an elevator because there is no elevator in it. We'll use this bread thing, too uh, Maybe there's something small in here that we can use. Yeah, you just use this can um, So I want to try and get the uh, the staircase or not staircase. It's a ladder I've, I've done that in the past I've called it a staircase many many times and that's a dumb thing to do because it's obviously a ladder um, I want to get this open so oh wait wait oh okay they changed the positioning of the windows on that room there okay so oh no he's coming around oh gosh okay let's let's just run around this side hopefully he won't be able to keep up with us oh my gosh what is this wait whoa 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 okay we've got a ladder on the side of the house we have to go to that right we have to oh my goodness the night is super super dark um let's go ahead and get caught so that we can move on from the night hey buddy yeah go ahead and grab me yeah that's perfect thanks pal thanks for resetting the game for me that's really nice of you is it still nighttime no it's daytime it's like morning this is a good time all right let's go around the side i want to go up this ladder see where this takes us oh no he's following us already gosh he's, he sees us he sees through walls what in the world is going on here Holy moly! So the surveillance system makes its epic return. We haven't seen this surveillance system in a long time. I think this was last seen in Alpha 1. Oh my gosh, he came up! Ah! No, no! Oh man, oh goodness. Okay, so Alpha 1 was the last time that we saw that surveillance room. If you recall, we had that room that we had to go into. There was a lock pick in there. Now we've got this dedicated area that looks really, really cool. I really want to get back up there, but the neighbor, he, he really is keeping an eye on this stuff. Okay, let's see if we can sneak around. Hopefully he won't hear us or see us. Okay, I think we made it without getting caught by him. So let's go ahead and go up the ladder. We kind of heard him like grunting as he was going up the ladder. That was kind of interesting. Okay, let's break this open. Hopefully he doesn't hear that. I don't think he did. And let's check this out. We've got a switch here. So, okay, that turns off the whole entire surveillance system. Oh my gosh this thing is extremely elaborate holy cow okay can we get in here nope and this one i think is locked as well there's a light switch uh that doesn't do anything for us okay that is really really interesting is there anything in the drawers over here let's see maybe a lock pick nothing there's nothing in here okay so it seems that the only thing in this room is the surveillance system did i bump into that i did okay don't don't bump into it because it'll turn it back on uh let's drop down into the bottom floor and let's go ahead and do some more exploration here. Okay, let's pop in here. Hopefully he's not around. Let's go ahead and open up the refrigerator door here. Okay, the key card is still in there. Is there anything else hiding in there? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's move along. Let's move down the hallway, try to make our way upstairs. Oh, it sounds like he might be getting close to us. I don't know exactly where he is, but it seems like he might actually be kind of close. Can we open this? No, we can't open that. We have to open it from the other side. Okay, let's go upstairs and let's make our way over here. And I want to get the key to unlock that door. So let's go ahead, go in here, get through there, 
jump through there. Okay, let's open this. That opens that gate. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Let's let's close that. Close that up. Let's pretend that never happened. Um, let's go ahead and try to open this. See if this button is the same. I think it is. There we go. Okay, yep, that opens that up. All right, let's go in through here, and then we need to get through here. Yeah, this is what we need. So let's try to make this jump nice and clean. Huh! Oh, no, I messed it up. Hello. Hi. Um, just, just don't look this way. Please, just keep... Okay, good. We got through. Okay, let's, let's go through here. Um, did he hear that? I think he may have heard that. Let's just, let's just jump through the window. Okay, it's very, very dark right now. I don't like how dark it is. I don't know why I'm playing at dark. Normally, I avoid doing that, but in this case, I'm just gonna have to make do with it. Oh, get away, get away, get away. No, 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 no. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I fell down the stairs. Oh my goodness. Okay, get outside, get outside, get outside. No, he caught us. Okay, at least there's a silver lining. It's daytime now, so that's good, that's good. Let's open up the elevator room. Let's go ahead and go over to the side of the house here, and let's try to use this apple to get ourselves access to the ladder, elevator, whatever it is. Okay, I don't think he sees us, so we're in a good situation. Try to hit this, oh, no, no, he was standing right there. Why was he just standing, waiting for us there? Oh my goodness, he's gonna get us with the glue. Come on, get away, get away, get away, get away. Okay, we're safe, we're good, we're good, we're golden. You mind your own business, pal. Okay, right now, all we have is the bread thing to try and open up that door. So I'm gonna grab another can here. Maybe this coffee cup will do the trick. Uh, maybe another apple, we'll try that. Okay, we need to have better aim this time. Okay, he's going back inside. Yeah, go inside your house. Close the door, close the door. He's probably heading in this direction. So I gotta be real quick about this. Okay, let's try to get this. Huh. Nope, that was a miss. Huh. There we go, we got it. All right, we got that door open. So now he can actually follow us up that room though. So we can't get away from him just by running up the stairs or up the ladder. I keep calling it stairs, it's so dumb. And they also changed the layout of this room. Look at this, we've got like a little step ladder here. I think that makes getting up a lot easier. Yeah, because remember how hard it was to get in and out of the ladder? It was an absolute nightmare. So this makes it so much easier. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go up here. And let's see, what in the world is this? Okay, we've got water. Is the shark back? Oh man, is the shark monster back? No, he's not. We are actually underwater. I think this is the first time that we've made it into a room that we were supposed to actually be in and be underwater in Hello Neighbor. This is very, very strange. There's a lot of weird stuff going on that I cannot make sense of anymore. Also, apparently we have gills, so we can breathe underwater. That's pretty cool. I think we're gonna have to come back to this room. It seems like it's got one of those, uh, those like record player things that is out in the yard. I wonder if we take the golden apple to this area, if it'll take us to another cutscene. I don't know, we may have to try that out in the future, but in the meantime, I'm really, really focused on trying to get to the final boss battle because it just seems so stinking cool and I really wanna show it off to you guys. Okay, let's go downstairs and let's see, where does this take us? I actually forget everything here. What, what, this takes us to the roof? I don't know if I wanna do that. Can I get through here? I can, okay, that just takes us over there. Um, oh, there's another one of those things. The record players, they're all over the place. I wonder if you can actually interact with them now, like pick them up and take them different places. Um, I'm kind of tempted to jump to the train tracks, but I don't know if I wanna do that. That could be a bad decision, but if I drop down here, I'll just be on the roof. Okay, you know what, let's go ahead and give this a shot. Let's drop down here, come on, let me down. Are you gonna let me down? Please, there we go, okay, we got down. Now we're on the roof. I'm not sure what this is gonna do for us, but we are on the roof, good for us. Let's see if we can go around, ooh, ooh, okay. Well, no, 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 Well, I slid down the side of the roof and ultimately broke all my legs, all two of them. I wonder what that generator does up there. That is, that is very interesting. I wonder if it's connected to anything that we need to actually get to the basement now. I wonder if they changed up the puzzle to actually get to the basement. I don't know. There's a lot of crazy stuff going on. I'm very, very confused. Oh man, they're changing too much on me. I was so comfortable in Alpha 4. Why have they changed so much in Beta 3? No, that's okay. Change is good. Change is good. You have to accept change. Let's try to get back upstairs and see if we can make use of the new areas that we found. Oh gosh, oh no, 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 please stop, stop chasing me. Okay, he went back inside. So I'm gonna try and go this way. I'm gonna break this window. 
Oh gosh, he's coming straight for me. Get upstairs. Get go 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 up the ladder. Come on. We can make it. He's gonna follow us though. I actually want to see the animation. Let's see. Is he following us? No, he didn't follow us. The animation for him climbing the ladder is actually really cool. You can see it in the producer's update video. Um, but but I wanted to show it off here. We'll see if we can make it happen. Let's go to the very top. And again, this takes us to the watery room. This is not where I want to be. I want to go back over here. And I guess we'll go downstairs. And this time we're going to try to jump to the train tracks. Let's go. Oh, I missed it. I, I totally messed up that jump so badly. That was terrible. All right, let's run around the back here. And let's see if we can sneak in. Oh, what? How? He didn't even, he wasn't even near me. Okay, this guy is crazy. He can see through walls. I guess we already knew that. Let's try to get through the front door. Okay, we got through the front door. Let's go upstairs and try to get the blue key. So I'm gonna go up this way and let's go ahead and jump through here. Jump across, get through there. All right, we made it. Now, oh man, he's putting bear traps everywhere. Oh my goodness, that hurts. Let's try and make this jump. I don't want this box though. The box is kind of bugging me. Okay, let's let's try to do this. Huh! All right, we made it that time. Very good. Now, does this actually do anything for us? Oh, that's right. We need to throw something at that that thing over there, and that painting's not gonna work. I need something in my inventory. Okay, it needs to be small enough to fit through there. Okay, this will work. Yes, take that. Um, is there anything else? Maybe the watering can. Uh, maybe the plant. I don't. I don't think the plant's gonna work. Can Can he make it over here? I don't know if he can make it over here. He's gonna try. He's going to try very, very hard. So that makes me very nervous. Okay, let's go ahead and get back over here. Let's see if we can make this jump. All right, we made it. Okay, we made it. We're good. We're good. All right, hit that. Oh, that was a miss. Okay, try this again. Huh? What? Come on. Ah! No! Come on! I just wasted all the things that I was gonna use to try and open this thing up. This is not working out. This is not working out at all. Get back over there. Okay, we made it. Uh, can we get through any of these doors? Probably. Oh, hello! Oh my gosh! Oh, man, that was extremely surprising. Okay, let's grab things that are small enough to be thrown through that little hole. I don't know if this trash is gonna work. Like, does it have enough weight to it? You know what, actually? I go back to my house. I think that we had some pretty good items for throwing. Yeah, we have an apple. We have a can. That's good stuff. Even a banana. Let's get rid of this trash. Get that. Throw it in my own kitchen. That's kind of gross. Um, let's try out the banana here. The banana is the answer to all of our problems. Okay, let's try to get, get through here. Hopefully he didn't hear that. He heard it. He totally heard it. Oh my gosh. He was right on our butt. Man, I forget how hard actually playing this game is. It's a lot different when you have to actually play it and you can't just cheat through everything. We're not cheating today. We're playing the game legit and it's hard. It's real hard. Hopefully he didn't hear that. Oh, he totally heard it. Yep, he absolutely heard it. I don't know where he is, but he is chasing us right now. Where is he? Where is he? I don't see him. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna go up here. This is probably not gonna do anything for me, but I'm gonna do it. Grab this can. And I wonder, actually, can we break that? And then can we jump through there? Oh my goodness, I'm really actually quite surprised that we were able to make that jump. <laughs> that was great. Let's grab an umbrella. All right, leave this Chinese food here. Get this open. Get out of here. No, that is not what I wanted to do. I want to get the chair. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, grab the can. We'll keep that for later. Okay, we made it to the surveillance room. So now we have, like, easier access, I guess. Um, we can also grab the golden key, and we can open this door. So let's get rid of this can. Let's get this guy open. And um, this hasn't done a whole lot for us because we're still kind of trapped in this room. We have to get this door open with the golden key in order to get access to the other side. Now, what's the best way to do that? Well, that's a great question. I don't actually know. I think we just have to kind of go through here and do it the old-fashioned way. Actually, while we're down here, let's uh, let's get rid... Whoa, whoa. What happened there? I'm not sure how to explain what just happened. I'm not cheating, I promise. I just randomly teleported. Okay, get that guy open. That's not gonna open. Okay, um, we got a bunch of bear traps. This is a pain. Get these things out of here. Tripping bear traps with bear traps. He's got so many bear traps. There's too many bear traps. All right, he's on the back side of the house. So I'm just gonna go straight through the front door. Try this out. Let's try to get upstairs again. And we need to get the blue key. That's our goal right now, is getting the blue key and getting access to this upstairs room. Okay, let's... Oh, that was a bad jump. Why did I do it that way? That was very dumb. Let's go. Come on. Oh my goodness, why am I having such a hard time with this jump? Come on. There we go. 
There we go. That's the way to do it. If you're having a hard time with that jump, you're going to have a lot of trouble with this jump right here. Hopefully, we can make it. Make it happen. Oh, you know what? Actually, first, I should open this door. Let's get this guy open. And let's use uh, the, the lock and the key as possible lever hitters. So we're going to try and throw these at the lever over here. Let's get this guy open. Huh. All right. There we go. And then let's try to hit this. Eh. That didn't work. Oh, there we go. Nice. Nice. All right. We got it. Now we have access to this room. What is this? I'm going to assume that this says some kind of celeb congratulations, maybe. I don't know. I, I don't know. I have no idea what that says. Uh, this is going to open up this thing, so we don't really want to mess around with this. And I just noticed there's a cake in the middle of this room. This is getting weird. This is getting real, real weird. Okay. Um, he's nearby. I think he knows that we're up here. That makes me real nervous. Let's grab this, and then let's grab the key. Let's grab the key. Here we go. All right. Let's drop this. Don't fall through the floor like you did in the last version. Okay, get rid of the magnet gun. We don't need that anymore. Now, we do need to get back where we came from. Um, and he may actually be on the other side. Oh, there he is. There he is. Okay, let's jump back over here. Oh, we made it. Okay, and then let's go over here and then get back on this side and then we can go up here hopefully we can get in here and close the door behind us and he'll never know that we were up here we're good we're safe everything's great oh that's right i did need the magnet gun wait i didn't need the magnet gun where's the crowbar what happened to the crowbar this is a whole new puzzle what is going on here um th there's a gate here moving up and down where's my crowbar at i don't know where the crowbar is anymore guys this is not good. Okay, this is very strange. And what is this? What is going on here? Oh my goodness, there's so much different stuff here. Everything's different. I don't know what to do anymore. This takes me out here. And then there's there's an electrical box over here. What am I supposed to do with that? I do not understand. Ah, no! How did you get up there? What? Where did he come from? He can get anywhere basically now. This is really, really terrifying. Well, we don't need the golden key anymore. Uh, we got the blue key, and then we got into that room, but I'm not sure what to do with that room because I went up there specifically to get the crowbar. The crowbar's not up there anymore, or at least I didn't see it, so maybe we have to get back up there. I don't know. This is all very, very confusing, but I think that we have easy access now to that other room so we should be able to get back up here pretty easily um i think if we just break this window oh come on umbrella work with me nope you're not very good for breaking windows so you're good for floating but not breaking windows okay let's go ahead go through here this should be open now yep okay that's good and then this one should be open as well great now we have very very easy access back to this area oh we can't open that one why oh there's a chair on the other side oh man i didn't remove the chair Oh, shoot. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. At least we can get through here, and then we can go over on this side of the gate, and then we can get back up to the blue key room. Everything is still open, and we're good to go. Now, this, this is all very different from what it used to be. What is, wait, there's light bulbs, and then they turn off, and then they turn on, and is this some kind of sequence here? I wonder if there's a sequence of buttons we need to press in the order that these lights are switching on. Oh my gosh, that is very strange. I uh, oh, Can we get it through? We got through. Uh, we actually got through. Um, is there anything over here, though? There's nothing over here. Why, why would we come over here, then? There's a globe. I mean, this makes me feel very special that I now have a globe in my hands, but it's not doing anything for me. This isn't going to help me get into the basement. Okay, that... That was a waste. I, I don't know what that's for. This is all very, very confusing to me. Okay, you know what? Let's go back upstairs. Let's go back into this room. And let's try going into the, I think, the supermarket. They did mention that the fear maps have been updated or changed. So I wonder if the supermarket has been uh, changed at all. Maybe we can go into that room. So let's go ahead. Oh, no, he's in there. He's in there. Never mind. I don't want to go in there. Changed my mind. <laughs> Never wanted to go in there in the first place. Not interested at all. Um, okay, this got a lot more complicated. There used to be only six buttons. Now there's 12. That's messed up. Why would you guys do that? That's real messed up. And also, is that a whole nother room? 
<laughs> I think that's a whole nother room. Oh my goodness, it just keeps getting more and more complicated. There's so much going on in this new version. It's almost overwhelming. Is the golden apple seed over here? Please tell me the golden apple seed is still hanging out. He's not over here anymore. Oh man, that bums me out too. So much has changed. My goodness, I don't know what to do. Okay, and then here's this weird... Oh, the red key is over here. It has changed its position. Okay, so I guess you kind of have to get on the other side of this room here is... What? I don't... Oh, you have to break open that? How do you break that open? So much confusion. A bunch of basketballs here. What am I supposed to do with a bunch of basketballs? Why does the neighbor have all these basketballs? Can I... Nope, that didn't do anything. My goodness, there's a lot of weird stuff going on. Can I hit this? Maybe. No, I missed. Try it again. Come on, hit it. Nope, that didn't do anything. Ooh, maybe there's a button on the other side. Maybe I can hit it from here. Eh, nope, couldn't fit it. Come on, come on, work with me here. Work with me. Nope, not gonna go through. Okay, that's fine. Does this door open? Yes, it does, and it just drops. Oh, ooh. Oh, there's our crowbar. All right, we'll go ahead and grab you. Ow, ow, hot, hot, hot. Okay, go ahead and drop that over there. So now we can go back, get the magnet gun, put that in the refrigerator, but we still need to melt the uh, the key card. So I opened it up, but I don't think I turned the refrigerator off. And to turn the refrigerator off, I think we have to go up the ladder. So let's try and get back to that area. This is crazy. Let's see if we can make this jump. Huh! Oh my gosh, I can't believe I made it. And this is where that secret is. Um, let's see if it's still here. Is it? Can we, can we get through? It is. The Unreal Engine missing script is still here, and it teleports us to our doom. Oh my goodness. What in the world? You just sent me to the middle of nowhere. I'm just gonna die out here. That's messed up. Am I ever gonna die? There's smoke out there. What, what is that? Why is there smoke in the middle of nothing? That is very strange. I'm very confused by everything that is happening right now. What is going on? Okay, you know what? I think there's an option to restart. Let's go ahead and restart. So now we can manually restart the game without having to get caught, right? Does that... It doesn't reset my entire game, right? It does not reset our entire game. We're still good. Just don't hit new game. Yeah. Restart safe. New game restarts your entire game. Don't mess around with that. Is this a VHS tape? It is. What does that say? I have no idea. If you guys know what that says, let me know. <laughs> okay, so let's check to see if the key card has melted. I don't think it has because we haven't turned the refrigerator off. Although, maybe all you have to do is just open up. Hey, hello. Hi, pal. Uh, it's really great to see you. I'm so happy that you're here. You're awful. I just want to check out your refrigerator, see if the key card is ready to go. Can you, can you stop doing what you're doing? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Where are you going? What are you doing? Okay, you're gonna put another bear trap down probably knowing you you're gonna put another bear trap down Yep, he's putting down another bear trap. I called it. Okay. Let's go around the back. Let's see. Hopefully he doesn't see us I don't think he did. Okay. I think we're okay So we should be able to sneak in through this way. We opened up this door and then we can just go into the kitchen um, There's there's this thing though. I don't like this get this out of here. Okay. Is the key card melted? I don't think it is Yeah, it's not it's, it's very not melted. We need to turn this off. Oh gosh, get away from me. Stop chasing me. You done? Don't shake your head like that. It's rude. Okay, it looks like he's going around the side of the house. So I'm gonna go in straight through the front door. Go ahead and trip this guy. Oh no, he's chasing us. Oh, get away from me. I need to go up the ladder, up the ladder. Come on, get up the ladder. If we can make it up the ladder and just at least get to the generator and hit the generator, then we can start the process of melting the uh, the ice cube that's holding the key card. So let's go ahead and go in here. And it's not here anymore. Oh no, they changed it up on me again. Is it the generator that's on the side of the house inside of that cage? It probably is. Okay, let's try to make it to the train. Let's... Uh, there we go. We finally made it. Oh, but this doesn't do us any good because it's all roped off. Well, we can go over here. Let's go ahead and go over here. What is this? This is a different area. Have I ever been here before? Can we pick this thing up? We can actually pick this thing up now. So it's not quite as interesting as it used to be. Maybe if we bring a golden apple to it, something will happen? I don't know. I don't think so, though. Okay, let's go through here. Let's get this guy open. I have no idea where this is going to take us. Oh, okay. This is the uh, 
the moon, the sun and moon room. Okay, so we're not going to worry too much about that right now. Again, our main focus is getting to the basement. I want to see this quote-unquote boss fight. Okay, let's float on over. Oh, nope, I missed it. I really thought that was going to get me through. What, was he down there? He was down there. I think he can make it up here, so I'm a little bit nervous about this. Let's go ahead and open this guy up. Okay, this takes us over here. Oh my goodness, he can definitely make it up here. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm gonna fall down. I'm gonna fall. Ah, let's just float down. Let's just float down gently, gently, softly, safely. Okay, there's a there's a camera too. I think I need to turn off the surveillance system. Let's turn this off. See if that does anything for us. Let's go upstairs and let's see if the surveillance system is back on. I guess he, he could turn it back on. Yeah, he definitely turned it back on. So let's turn it off so that the cameras don't catch us anymore. So now the question is, how do we get the key card? That is the question. And I do not have the answer. I have no idea. Okay, this is, this is that outside room. So that's cool to know. How do you suppose we get to the generator that's on the side of the house? I think we need to get... A little bit of surveillance done here so let's check this out let's see there is the generator right there and I'm assuming that that's connected to the refrigerator I could be wrong though I could be completely off but the question is how do we get there okay I feel like if we get on the tracks in the right spot we'll be able to get to the oh my goodness we'll be able to get to the train station and turn on the train get away from me man don't stop just just stop what you're doing stop everything that you're doing okay that didn't work out very well we need to get back up there <laughs> i'm really failing at these jumps all right let's get back to the ladder okay let's try this jump again there we go we made it okay so the question is can we get around these i don't think we can i'm gonna try though i'm gonna try with my umbrella skills oh maybe actually if i go this way oh you know what i think we're onto something here come on come on Get there, get there, yes, yes, no, we can't get in there, it's blocked off, oh no, I have completely forgotten how to get to the train station, maybe if we go in this room here, I don't know where this goes, let's try to break this open, yeah, okay, get this guy, alright, get in there, what in the world is this, what have I just discovered, well, if nothing else, I discovered cake, and that's delicious, let's go ahead and eat that up, okay, maybe not, maybe it's a little stale, what is going on here? This is too weird. I think this is what's controlling that gate down below us. Yeah, that gate that we saw in the room where the crowbar used to be. You remember the lights? They were all kind of randomly getting flipped on and off. This is why. Can we turn these things off? We can't. Can we, can we like knock them over? What the heck? What are we supposed to do with this? Can we jam it up with some cake? Maybe if we take out all the ammo? I don't know. I don't know what we're supposed to do. I guess what you could do is you could take boxes, if you find boxes, I don't know if there's boxes around here, oh, that's locked, where does that take us? I don't know, but I guess what you could do is you could take boxes and you could block the shots from hitting these levers, now I don't know what that actually accomplishes, because we got on the other side of that gate and there was nothing there, so this could all just lead to a lot of disappointment. This is a very strange room, why is there an apple tree growing in the corner? Why are there little apple trees? Or are these tomato trees? I don't know. I'm very confused by everything that's going on here. Can I can I take this fruit? No, I cannot. Here's that water thing. So we can we can free the water from here. What is this? Oh, video game news. <laughs> they got an Easter egg. That's pretty neat. Hey, just throwing it out there, Tiny Build, you know. Uh I've heard of this this kindly Kean guy. Um I, I, you know, he, he might he might think it would be pretty neat if there was some kind of Easter egg in the game. You know, I'm just, just throwing it out there. Anyways, let's move along. Still can't get in this room. And still don't know exactly how. A lot has changed in this house in Beta 3. I'm actually pleasantly surprised on how much has changed. In the producer's update video, they mentioned that this game holds about 40% of the total content for the complete game. So there's still a lot more to see, but 
what I'm seeing right now is completely throwing me off because they've changed so many puzzles here. This is going to be really, really interesting. But guys, unfortunately, I'm out of time for today. So we're going to have to save exploring the house and hopefully getting to that final boss for the next episode. But that is going to do it for this episode of Hello Neighbor. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that circle with my logo in it right below this window. But that is going to do it thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys next time